Hey everybody, the Gaming Rehab here, and in this video tutorial, I'll be showing you how to make Minecraft run smoother with less lag, just generally run a lot better. So, uh, and you can play with far render distance, finally. So anyway, uh, I will just, I'll be showing you that, that this will actually work. I'll be, okay guys, I'm back in Minecraft, and on, and on max FPS, far normal render distance, fast graphics and minimum smooth lighting as you see it runs generally very bad I uh, like I, I I just get very bad FPS almost all the time and it is just not good at all anyway so let's just get started in the tutorial to make it better so step one is installing Optifine mod and this can this is very easy but wait, what you just want to do scroll down and press download first link in the description download and then uh, just download the jar file. Then this one, and if it isn't a jar, it's fine. If it's a zip, just do the same thing with me. And you just want to go to 1.6.4 recommended and download the installer on Minecraft Forge. Now that you have both of those, what you want to do is just get Forge, double click on there, and press OK that to install the client. Okay, so as you see, I've Optifine there now. What you want to do is just press percent go in the search bar and type percent app data percent and press enter It'll take you to roaming and go to dot minecraft and you want to scroll down and go and other create a folder called mods mods or just find one if it is there so now what you want to do is drag optifine right into the into the mods folder now it is done <clears throat> okay so now on to step two and this will be installing Razer Game Booster. Now just click the third link in the description. It might, may not be third anyway. Just press download now. Um, Razer Game Booster dot exe. As you see, it, ta it takes very short. Is that there's? It's not hard at all to download. It, it gives you steps on how to run in and everything. I don't want to run that. I already have it. Stupid thing. Anyway, guys, uh, that is a very simple thing. But I'll show you how to use that a little bit more when we open up Minecraft. Now on to step three. This one is probably the most important, or maybe depends. But anyway, right-click on computer, you go to properties. Okay, so it's right there. It says you have six gigs of RAM. Uh, how many gigs of RAM you have? Keep keep that in mind. Say if you have four, then remember it. And now go to advanced system settings right there. Go to performance settings. Go to advanced. In performance options, and go to change. Now it's a, it'll say how how much. Let's say how much data is actually um. Calculator. It'll say how much space is actually available. And what I like to do because that is how many that is actually the amount of space on your computer. And just to make it this just makes it run a little bit better and everything. So um. I take it five four nine seven five four nine seven three five and I divide that by two or three uh, I'm gonna do three right now and what I get is one eight three two four five and then I'll just paste that in most of these but how you get that is say how many gigs of RAM did your computer have if it, if it came with four gigs what you want to do is just simply Simply type, simply type 1024 times 4, then 4096. Then what you want to do, um, then you can either just put 496 in there, which I wouldn't recommend doing, but I would just get the, get that and divide it by 2 or 3, whatever it might be, and just press set. Uh, set. Okay, uh, you need to research your computer to make it fly, but that doesn't matter. So, okay, okay, everything, uh, restart later. Because I'm recording, obviously, then I can't restart it now. Okay, guys, so, uh, let's, final step. This is probably the most important. Minecraft.exe, and we're not going to be even running it yet, actually, but, um, yeah. Okay, uh, under your main profile, the one you, you, ah, crap. 
You guys, now if there's a profile called Optifine, use that. But if there's one just called Forge, then you want to use that. Well, okay. So you go to Edit Profile, and right here it'll say how many gigs you want to use. And if you have six gigs of RAM, um, you you either you want to use somewhere between three, four, or five. And I use four because I I like to keep my computer to do some other stuff as well. But anyway, uh, how much you want to do? Just save it, and then play but before I do any of that I'm just gonna restart my computer so the settings actually apply from the last step okay guys I'm back and what you want to do now is just open up Razer Game Booster and I just reset my thing so the paging file memory should be all normal and good now so I'll just reset my computer Razer Game Booster uh, hopefully this will work uh, okay initializing Game Boosters opening and I know this video is kind of long but if you do all the steps it will work I'm sure of it okay so now game booster is finally opening and what you what you can do now is just drag the, the program you want in there okay so I want to launch minecraft so now now it'll boost your game it just make, makes all makes it run good I guess Okay, uh, closing in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6. Okay, finally, Minecraft is now opening. Okay, now let's just double check all the settings, make sure 4 gigs, uh, all that good, and press play. Okay, guys, now Minecraft is open. You go into mods, you can see I have Optifine, um, this Forge here, Brian mod. I don't know why I have that, but. That was from a pre previous video. Now let's go into single player. Same world. Exactly the same settings. And look at this, guys. Minecraft, it doesn't, pretty much doesn't have lag anymore. It runs smoothly. I can do whatever I want to do. Uh, it, there's no, FPS has improved so much. Jump up here. There we go. Well, anyway, guys, I honestly hope this worked for you, and if it does, just drop a like in the video. I put lots of effort in this one, and uh, see you next time on the Gaming Rehab. Peace.